。喉大丈夫ですかうん、大丈夫ですよ。My throat is 100% okay. Do not worry about me, guys. 日本語上手になっててびっくりした。いや、そんなことないよ。まだ勉強中です。かんえー、っと、漢字全然読めないとか、えー、っと、文法がいつもめちゃくちゃになってのうとか、そして、語彙力いつもいつも足りないのでまだあんまり上手だじゃないでももっと勉強したいですあそれに発音もめちゃくちゃペラペラですよいえいえいえ褒めてすぎるじゃん<笑>まだまだです Even though I'm able to say simple things I wanna be able to hold a back and forth a lot without having to think about what it is that I'm saying because when you're Proficient enough in a language, you don't have to think about what you're saying, you just do. Like, for example, right now, I am speaking a sentence while I'm making up what I'm gonna say as I'm saying it. I can't do that in Japanese because I need to stop and think, what about,、uh, think about what I'm about to say, what, I'm gonna, what words I'm gonna use,、um, where those words are gonna go, how I'm gonna say those words, the inflection and all that. It's just like ingrained into me. And that's when you know that you actually. Are proficient in a language, not necessarily flu like a native level, not at all. I would not say that I'm native, le native,、eh, native level in any language, but I am fluent in at least two. So, you're thinking in English? I don't know. Depends. Sometimes I'm thinking in English, sometimes in Swedish, and occasionally in Japanese, but not very often because how am I supposed to think in a language that I don't speak properly? <laughs> わかる。めっちゃわかる。I, I totally get that. I also want to learn that. That's the, the reason why I want to learn diff different languages because English, even though it's a very widely spoken language all over the world, there are parts of the world where English is not so common and、uh, you can't just rely on it to get by. There are countries that are very, very proficient in English. For example, you can go to Sweden and not have to worry about knowing Swedish at all because everybody speaks fluent English. Whereas, if you go to some place in Japan, then if you don't speak Japanese or like even a little bit of Japanese, you are going to struggle. But there, there's more to a language other than just like asking for directions or paying a bill. I want to be able to have a conversation and sort of talk. If I just want to know, excuse me, where's the station, like th th that's not really a ho whole conversation. I want to be able to just sit down with somebody、uh, at a pub or something, have a drink, and talk about. Whatever. If I just ask him what time is it, then that conversation is not going to be very long lived if you catch my drift. Mike's English is not very long lived if you catch my drift. Mike's English is not very long lived if you catch my drift. Mike's English is not very long lived if you catch my drift. Mike's English is not very long lived if you catch my drift. Mike's English is not very long lived if you catch my drift. Mike's English is not very long lived if you catch my drift. Sugo. That's amazing. Holy crap. A hundred days of Duolingo? That's a, that's a streak and a half. You sound native, actually. Sometimes, maybe, but a lot of the times you can hear my accent peeking out, especially if you know what you're looking for. People from other countries that are, don't have English as their native language or people from the UK, they can sometimes assume that, oh, you're from NA, aren't you? But people from NA, especially from、um, the US, are just kind of like, yeah, English is not your native language. And the reason for that, when I ask them, like, how did you figure that out? Oh, it's because I can't place your accent anywhere. You sound like you're from several different places or nowhere at all. So I, I, I guess that makes sense. Because I picked up a lot of my English from various different sources. I, not a specific accent in particular. And they watch us rise. We hear it, but we love you. Thank you. I appreciate it. As long as I can make myself understood, that, that's something that you should keep in mind no matter what language you're speaking. Don't worry about having an accent. If you can make yourself un understood and you can say the words properly and people understand the words that you're saying and you can have a back and forth, who cares if you have an accent? If anything, I think accents are charming. <laughs>